everybody, this is Dr. Lori. Um, on today's blog, I just wanted to go over um, a phrase that's from the Bible, and I wrote about it in one of my blogs, actually, from Easter Sunday, but I just wanted to take a couple minutes to go over that um, concept with you because I think it's interesting, and I never really thought about this because it took maturity to actually get it. So, you know that phrase, the do unto others as you would have them do unto you? Uh, love thy neighbor as thyself. We've all heard this. We interpret it that basically you want to treat others very, very well because that's how you want to be treated in return. What we forget during this entire philosophy, though, is how do we treat ourselves? So we may in turn treat others very well and we use that philosophy and we use those sayings to treat others well but always remember that it begins with self-love so how do you treat yourself how do you talk to yourself what are the messages that you're sending to yourselves and this is really important because in any healing journey and i talk about it in my book that's coming out this summer um, that it all starts with what you're saying within so the messages that you're sending strongly to your cells is exactly what your cells, your body, is going to give you back in return, in dividends. So if you're telling your body bad stuff, and if you're using negative words and you're speaking um, hate unto yourself, when you look in the mirror, if you, if you have very, uh, very high negative um, feelings towards yourself, your cells are going to respond and they're going to give you back negative results in the form of disease and illness and broken bones and stubbed toes and stuck in traffic and all that negativity stuff. So when we say love thy neighbor as thyself, do unto others as you would have, do un have them do unto you. Let's first remember the philosophy of self-love and love thyself first and foremost. Because when you love yourself and you wish upon yourself goodness and prosperity and abundance, then the universe and God will bring you that in return. You won't believe how beautiful that you can be when you tell yourselves that you're beautiful. So in closing, love thy neighbor as thyself. Love thyself first and foremost. Have a beautiful day.